What's going on you guys? It's your buddy Sage and this is your weekly Moab. This is the gameplay where I like to bring you where I kind of just uh, tear it up and um, get a good gameplay and I talk about stuff that is uh, not related to video games. So um, I get kind of lucky barely staying alive here uh, to get my Moab but it's a pretty decent gameplay. Um, so if you guys have been watching my videos or paying attention to my channel at all, uh, you know that I just had surgery. I'm doing this commentary two days after uh, getting out of surgery. I had surgery on my left shoulder. And um, so it's been a few hours since I've uh, taken drugs, so I'm not too loopy right now. Hopefully everything that I say should make sense and I shouldn't uh, mumble or whatever too much. Uh, if I do, then I apologize, but you guys will have to deal with it, because uh, I'm doing commentaries anyway. Um, so this is one of the uh, most, I don't know, dramatic, uh, interesting experiences of my life, guys. Um, I mean, I've never had to do anything like this, never had surgery, never broken a bone. Um, the only major thing I've had is fractured my toe, <laughs> really. Um, and I've uh, gotten stitches a few times and stuff like that, but um, <clears throat> yeah, this is kind of a big deal. So I, I, uh, what happened was I went in for surgery Monday morning. Uh, had to be, had to go drive. Well, my mom drove me about an hour or so uh, at four in the morning, and um, my surgery was scheduled for 7:30 or so. So they uh, went in there, prepped me. I stripped down, got in the gown. Um, they stuck, oh, funny story, so um, they're giving me um, an anesthesia, right, as well as, I, I don't really know uh, the uh, the terms for them, but anyway, they're, they're going to knock me out with the gas, right, and they're also numbing the left side of my body, so they had to stick a needle in my neck uh, and uh, shoot me up to numb the left side of my body, so there's an anesthesiologist in there about to do that, and he's got an assistant and stuff. Uh, he's holding a huge needle in his hand, uh, and his assistant is talking about. Uh, he goes, "Oh, are you uh, you good to do this? You recovered from this weekend?" And I'm I'm laying there on the bed, going like, "Wait, what?" <laughs> and uh, and the guy with the gigantic needle in his hand is like, "Oh yeah, yeah, I'm I'm all right. It's, I'm not the same as I used to be, you know. In college, I could uh, I could hold my drinks a lot better, but now, you know." And then <laughs> the other guy's like, "Yeah, he, he got pretty drunk this weekend. Uh, we had a." Christmas party and I'm like are you serious can you tell me this like after you successfully stick this needle into my neck and inject like this this stuff into me did you really have to tell me this 10 seconds before you did it like uh, so th that was crazy but uh, it turned out okay um, I guess it's cool that they're having fun at, at the job on the job uh, <laughs> anyway so then I go in for the surgery and it's the first time I've ever been knocked out for anything uh, <sighs> Basically, they put a mask over my head or over my uh, mouth and nose, and I start breathing in and getting relaxed and stuff. And uh, the doctors are all doctors and nurses are talking about the procedure, and I'm just kind of laying there. Um, and I did. They didn't even get to the uh, okay count backwards from ten part. You know, <laughs> they, I, I don't even remember them saying that. I just remember uh, waking up, and uh, apparently it was a couple hours later. I woke up in a bed. Um, from the anesthesia and I had a sling on my arm and uh, it's all wrapped up and stuff and um, drove home I was pretty groggy I slept on the way home and all that fun stuff and um, I'm here now so I'm alive and it is pretty painful um, I can't really move at all like for a while so uh, it's kind of rough. I, I have actually been able to play video games a little bit. Uh, it does get sore, and I'm not quite as good as usual, but I've actually been pretty effective. Uh, uh, I go positive still. I do pretty well. Um, but I just can't play for extended periods like normal, or my uh, my arm starts to get really sore. Um, but that's my story. Uh, so I'm going to be locked down uh, in the house for a few more weeks, uh, hopefully doing commentaries. I don't know how good of gameplays I'll be able to get, but um, yeah, so I've been taking drugs every four hours, <clears throat> and uh, they really help, let me tell you. I went for a car ride today. Uh, I went with my mom to go pick up my brother from work, and um, 
it really hurt every little bump in the road, every movement of my arm. Uh, it hurts pretty bad. But um, the, uh, what's it called? The Percocet really helps. So, uh, and makes you feel pretty good. So that's always fun. Um, I got to go in tomorrow, uh, well, in the morning and uh, get my bandages changed, I guess. But um, it's just kind of weird. I've never, I, I'm really doing most of the same stuff that I would normally do, but I, I have to look at everything in a different light. And um, it, it's sort of like, this was a TV show and you guys were watching like just me uh, everything is like uh, slow motion really um, I mean not everything around me it's not because of the drugs it's because I literally have to move slower and be really careful about uh, the movements that I make otherwise uh, there's a piercing pain through my entire uh, shoulder and arm um, but when I'm just sitting around or when I'm watching TV or or whatever um, then it, it's kind of sore, but it's not too terrible. I've, uh, oh gosh. So apparently the, there's tons of side effects for the, the drugs that I'm taking, right? Um, one is itching, which I has been affecting me. Um, every time for about an hour after I take uh, these two pills, I, um, I'm itching everywhere, mostly my legs a little bit. Like I might fall asleep and then I'll just like have to scratch my face. Um, so that's kind of weird. I've never had a, a reaction like that to anything. Um, also, apparently, uh, I'm supposed to be really constipated. Uh, <laughs> it's supposed the drugs are supposed to make me really constipated, and I don't know. Fortunately or unfortunately, I haven't had the the pleasure of uh, of actually um, finding out if that's going to be the case. If it's going to mess with me like that. Um, but <laughs> but. Uh, not really excited to uh, look forward to that. Anyway, um, so that's what's going on for me. So I, I, uh, I am in some pain, but I'm doing all right. I get to play games still and get to talk. And um, yeah, so this is going to be my Moab, and I'm going to end the game because uh, after I die here in a minute, I, uh, I put my sniper on, and it doesn't really work out too well. I, I just go like 5-5 five and five or whatever for the rest of the game, so I don't... I don't want to make you guys sit around and uh, be bored for a couple minutes. So I'll just end the game here, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed the Moab. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed my story. I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about my surgery uh, in a couple more videos. And, um, of course, as usual, I'll see you guys in the near future with another video. Uh, comment and like and all that fun stuff, you guys. Have a good day, y'all. Peace.